it's Hannah with Highlander Central and I am live right now in the MCC Food Pantry. I am joined by Letitia Monzi and we are here to talk to you guys a little bit about the Food Pantry as well as the ongoing Thanksgiving fundraiser drive. So do you mind telling us a little bit about what the Thanksgiving drive is? Yeah, absolutely. So the Thanksgiving drive, it's an annual drive that we do every year on the MCC campus to help uh, staff and uh, students we need a lot of help around the holidays. We all know it's an expensive time of year. So trying to put, you know, a turkey and all the fixings on your table can be challenging. Um, so every year we raise money across campus from students, faculty, and staff who can give um, so that we can purchase a full meal. So we're talking turkey, we're talking mashed potatoes, pie, green beans, the works. I think something like eight or nine different things all in a package. Um, and so the Thanksgiving drive, uh, with the $25 that we purchased that food with from HEB, they're our partner in this, um, we're able to give out vouchers for students and a staff to go collect those meals um, at HEB so that they can feed their whole families. Oh wow, and so this is just the one time of the year fundraiser, yes. or the, the drive, um, which is for Thanksgiving specifically, but then of course we have the food pantry that is for all year round. That's right? true, yes. Absolutely. And so um, who all is eligible to come to the food pantry? Yeah, so um, MCC students, faculty, staff, anyone you need, as well as University Center students can come and use the pantry as well. Okay, and then um, if I were interested in donating specifically to the food pantry, how would I do that? Yeah, so you can always donate to the food pantry cash uh, check or online to the foundation. Um, it would basically just be mclennan.edu slash foundation, um, and you can just click on make a gift and then specify that you want it to go to the food pantry. Okay, and then is that the same way that you would donate for the vouchers It as is. Well? I have a little hand out here for you. Okay. Um, so you can go to mclennan.edu slash foundation, and you would click on make a gift, and then when you're designating who that gift goes to, in this case you would specify Thanksgiving Drive, or as you were talking about, you could designate it to just food pantry in general if you're wanting to supply this year round. Okay, um, other than monetary donations, what else can people donate yeah, to the yeah. pantry? Um, well, so uh, staff can actually help volunteer to uh, staff the pantry from noon till one, which is when we're open. Um, we do still serve students outside of those hours, but that's when we can get staff volunteers. Um, and if you wanted to just donate other things that can help us, we're always in need of like the full-size plastic bags you get grocery shopping, not the little ones that they put your meat in separately, uh -huh. but like the big ones, the big plastic bags, as well as egg cartons. Sometimes we get big crates of eggs and it helps to be able to portion them out for people in a nice sturdy container. Yes, no, that is nice. And then um, can you explain where you guys are located and what the hours are for students? Yes, so we have a temporary location location right now um, where we are right across the hall from advising um, but students can still check in at the completion center front desk and tell us that they need services or come directly to this new location if they know where it is um, from noon till one. Okay and so um, it's staffed always from noon till one during the week but any other times just go straight to the completion center? Yeah we always aim to have it staffed noon till one but outside of those times if, if the completion center is open which is Monday through Friday eight to five we'll always escort somebody to the pantry if they can't make that noon till one time. Okay, and then um, moving back to the Thanksgiving drive really quick. Um, if a student was interested in receiving one of those vouchers, what would they yes. do? So we're going to send out an email soon with all of those details, but that's going to be November 13th, which is, I believe, this coming Tuesday, so not tomorrow, but the day after. Um, and there'll be, a, you can line up at 9 a.m. and we'll give out vouchers until they're gone. And we're hoping to have about 150 this year, so more than ever before is what we're going for. Yes, and then, so of course, if you're interested in helping get some of those vouchers for students to be able to receive those Thanksgiving meals, always go ahead and go donate. Um, of course, like how we talked about earlier, there is the link um, that Tisha said, or I think we also included it here on the Facebook page for you as well. So uh, go ahead and help out wherever you can. Can I make one last play? Yeah, yeah. You don't have to donate the full $25. Okay. Any amount helps. So if you just contribute a dollar or $5, that helps go towards purchasing one of those Thanksgiving meals. And same for just the food pantry overall. Um, we really appreciate the canned good donations that some people bring, um, but also a dollar can go really far with our partnership with Central Texas Food Bank. So we can buy a lot of stuff with just a couple dollars with that partnership. Is it so definitely better for people to donate the money to you guys to let you buy the items that Yeah, us or the foundation directly mm -hmm. since they're the ones who keep our account. That works just as well. Okay, well thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks guys. Thanks y'all.